thank you for giving me someone from Peru who just goes mass feelings. You see how I just can't micro? My race takes fucking micro. My race takes micro, the race that I'm playing. It's so, it's so fucking stupid. Like I see it coming, it doesn't matter because the units won't react. The units won't fucking react. So he climbs up the ladder. He takes my points. Now I have to play another terrible player because I'm losing points to terrible fucking players. Okay, hold the phone. Hold the phone. Did a fucking League of Legends player just come in here and talk shit about idle shit? How many things do you control in that game, bro? Is it literally one thing? You go, there's a champion that you control two things on. Sick story. The most utterly skillless fucking scrubs. This is such a waste of my time to play these players. They don't want to be good, and that's good because they could never be good. This type of person is never going to excel at games. What they're going to do is get better than their immediate friends because they cheese every game. And stupid people look at it and be like, well, he just has an aggressive style. It's pretty strong, don't you think? His MMR is pretty high. No. I think he's actual garbage, actual trash. Not enough minerals. That. I'd have to pause it at every second of the game. I don't think that Zerg would be good at anything. This is just fucking terrible. If he has a rich dad, maybe he'd be a cell phone pro gamer. His dad didn't care how much money he spent on it. Maybe. Maybe. But it'd have to be the most pay-to-win thing in the whole world. This guy? Yeah, he's a beat Brodos. 100%. I told you. Every back. <laughs> you fucking clown. I really hope someone gets you, Artosis. I don't like the way you talk, Artosis, but I'm still watching you on Twitch TV, Artosis. Get the fuck out of here. You can still watch, I guess, if you want. I can't stop you from that. Don't fucking type in my chat anymore, garbage pail. What? No! I can't even. Oh my god, he has no gas. And this was the plan. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, he was so bad. Fuck. I really need to work on my micro. So stupid. There's so many things that were so fucking stupid about this game. Why do I always scout random players last? That's the main thing that I'm concerned about here. Why can I not just... First off, just don't put me against random players because they're shitheads and their entire strategies are based on me not scouting them. It is so stupid. Just showed me that you don't play StarCraft. Saying send two SCVs is not, not the end of the world. Minerals. You just showed me not that you don't play minerals. StarCraft. Not you don't play. You don't even have logical not facilities in your brain. First off, that would be the end of the world because my economy would be at zero and I wouldn't be able to afford any building. So it doesn't even matter what race he is. It doesn't even matter. Also on a four player map, I send two SCVs. Let's think about that for a moment. What if he's gasped the last spot I scout? Then it's even worse. It's even worse. So now I get to play a lag game. That's good. Oh, this... I fucked it up. I fucked it up too much. I don't think there's anything I can do. I'm, I have, like... I'm gonna have four... Six less units than I should have. Based on missed depots. Man. Just 
both zealots, literally not killing anything, not even a single marine, and then runs by my bunker with three goons. He runs by my bunker with three goons. It's so stupid, I don't even block it because I'm like, what? This couldn't, this can't be like what you would do. It's too stupid. <laughs> I'm so imbalanced. <laughs> the amount of skill it takes to do versus <laughs> versus the, the amount of skill to defend it is insane. It's so crazy. There's never been anything like this in any game. So much better. It doesn't even compute how much better you have to be. Like, I am not kidding. That is the easiest thing to do in the world. That guy isn't good at all. He's not good at all. No, you couldn't just bunk rush to you fucking moron. Goodbye. <laughs> what an idiot. What is wrong with that guy? Oh my God. Got like fucking three IQ points total. Has the same amount of IQ points as gates that go in the middle of the fucking map. You can bunker rush the same with Terran. Fucking idiot. Oh my God. Not enough minerals. You can bunker rush the Protoss. Yeah, that's happened before. <laughs> Maybe at your level, fucking E rank player. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. What a fucking asshole. It's so. God damn it. What the fuck? I don't even know what the fuck race is this. Yourself, honey guy in the chat. Fucking idiot. Let's see him talk shit now. <laughs> oh, guys, guys, I'm one of you. You have to be kidding me. How can this always happen? You know what? He deserves to kill all these fucking SCVs, clearly. He deserves to kill four SCVs by running by the bunker. It's pretty clear to me. I don't know why you guys don't get it. Is under attack. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. I read you. Good to go, sir. Report for duty. Not enough minerals. Astiel Nexus! So, I mean, at least I read that the goon was fucking late, right? But of course, it's coming exactly as I walk down the ramp to see what the fuck's going on. It's actually ridiculous. What's up, Marine Lord? You, your fucking game is so easy, TVP, compared to this shit. I want you to try some fucking Brood War TVP. Literal apes playing Protoss and Brood War. Literal apes. They just do fucking anything. It, do, it just anything. It could be anything that they're doing. Not enough minerals. 
enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Second, I moved my fucking SCB out from in front of the bunker. I'm like, well, it's too late for the Zergling rush now, so I can go back to mining at full capacity. And he's like, oh, I'm just late with the rush, is all. <laughs> I play random. I don't know. I don't know when I'm supposed to fucking hit with the Zerglings. You know what I like about this, guys, is that... Having lost so many games against terrible Protoss players, this is clearly my MMR is playing against people like this. Where they do the worst thing that you could ever come up with. Can you think of anything worse than sitting on two ba on one base, making five siege tanks, and then attack moving cross map and running through minefields? Can you come up with something worse? Like, if you really, if you sit down with a fucking think tank of people, can you come up with something worse than what this fucking guy did? Just the absolute shit of the world because people make gateways outside my base and they fucking take my gas and they do ling floods that actually come so late that it doesn't even compute. This is what I'm playing against. Can you see how this could be fucking annoying for me to play against people like this? How this might not be enjoyable at all. These are the worst players in the whole fucking world. And the reason why I keep getting dragged down into their fucking deaths... Does it kill you on the inside to compliment Protoss players when you're casting? I only compliment the good ones, bro. Go watch me cast a Harangi game and see what I say. <laughs> um, dude, this is... It's so bad. It's so bad. PvP is so fucking difficult that they drag me down to this level where, like, everyone... Like... That was the stupidest thing I've ever fucking seen. That was so bad. It's the tip yum yum. It's just so. Like, what if I had gone speed there? I would have maybe lost him if I had gone speed. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Well, here's a Protoss player on a big four-player map. So let's see if he's cross-spawns and I can't fucking do anything for at least 18 minutes. Or let's see if he just cheeses me. I don't know. Maybe a DT drop can come in and get me. Crazy. But this is... These are the people that I play against. These... This is what happens when I have a couple bad games where Protoss players just fucking randomly win against me with their stupid idiotic bullshit you get a few of those then you get a few more and then suddenly you're down here where these people that Terran I just played you know he wears velcro shoes there's no fucking way on earth that that guy can tie his own shoes there isn't a, there's no no there's no way But I get dragged down there by Protoss players. Protoss players with less than 200 fucking APM that just cheese. It's like, holy shit. Terrans that can't tie their fucking shoes. And fucking Protoss players. guy in the chat was right. He was never right. Thank you for your sub. Stay tuned. Hope you're well, buddy. Can't figure it out, guys. I don't know. <laughs> he has a forge running on two base? Or did he do something really weird, like expand to the top, top right? Could that be it?
Online. We got a sub that says I never get supply blocked to 44. I know! I know, that's funny. 44 is the hardest depot to hit, by far. Oh my god, it's the idiot that attack moved across the map with five siege tanks. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so when I targeted that, he just happened to have moved his siege tanks forward, and now I'm gonna lose. Because instead of my siege tanks firing back and killing all of his, because I had like three more, they fired at the bunker. That was one of the most unlucky things you guys have ever seen happen. Where, where's his army? What's he doing? Yes, sir. Fucking random army movements I've ever seen. Destination. Ready to roll out. Additional supply depots required. Come on. He didn't build. No, no, no. Why can't my fucking depots ever make? Absolutely. Oh, it's so stupid. What? No way! Why is he attacking here? Oh! I unseeged everything because I was going to reposition. I haven't ever seen that before. I've never seen this. Never seen this build. Where you go mass vulture, drop ship with siege mode, one base. See, it's another one of these builds where like, what if I had done anything but port there? Yeah, he plays for fun for sure. He plays for fun, you can tell. Because that looked like fun. The way that he tried some stupid fucking all in and as soon as I had units that fly, he had to leave the game. Oh, I guess like you did the thing that stops the thing I'm doing. <laughs> Why don't we just go? That's what he's doing. He logs on the ladder with a fucking, you know, a slot machine crank. He doesn't play with a mouse. He plays with a fucking slot machine crank. And when he sees my units, it's just the spinning shit on the slot machine. And unfortunately, he th saw that it was fucking three sevens for me. When the Wraith flew in and killed his dropship. What? Grom donated fifters. If your opponent gets mines first and you know it and you see mines, you're like, oh, I win. Right? Well, and the thing is, you might actually just win there, but speed vultures can't lose to mine vultures. It can't happen because they can choose when to engage, what angle to engage from, and run away when they need to. Uh, so you have to be very careful here. And I'm back. But right here, Scan has made a nice concave. Now look, this is nine vultures, seven vultures. But he had two marines, and he has a pre-made concave. Okay. This is why I was talking about hit your armory on time. Because if you don't have these two goliaths popping out, Technically, these vultures can come in and beat these. It's a very tough fight. It's a close fight, but they technically can do it. If you target well, if you move in there well, it can occur because he's up two vultures. Uh, so yeah, you have to nail those glides coming out. Okay. And Scan just started to hit. This is way better, right? So now you don't have to clear this area because, again, the armory was on time. That is really the key thing, and that's something I screw up a lot is getting that armory on time and making sure those Goliaths are out. So anyways, during this time, we've added two factories. We're getting siege tanks. Siege mode will start relatively soon here. Okay, here's your fifth tank. And now notice he switched into vultures. He's gonna do a couple rounds of vultures to gain some map control. He basically, Scan has enough units here and enough mines here 
that he can't really die to anything, right? And he has Vulture Speed. So he can reinforce really quickly with his Speed Vultures. But don't forget, your opponent went Vulture really heavy for a bit and now is switching into the other mechanical units. So this is the part where if you make like two rounds of Vultures, three rounds of Vultures, which is going to take you about a minute of production time, suddenly you're going to have more Vultures than him. And that's really great. Now, you don't have to do this part, I don't think. I think it's good, especially at a higher level, to be able to kind of run. Identify target. What do you want, sir? What do you want? <laughs> 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 oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is one special moment in e-gaming. What do you want? Fucking so stupid. I lost all my SCVs at the beginning of that game. This is every TVT in my fucking life. Get infinitely far behind because every baboon can go three factory vulture, fight back for a fucking hour, and then barely lose. Terrible. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> I have this. I'm always in your stream watching and then I stream snipe you. I'm got, <laughs> don't forget I got S rank with 100 Not APM. Not enough minerals. This can't even be real. This can't even it can't even be fucking real. Right? 99% bunker. He gets the 99% bunker. Minerals. Guys, this is not actually hurting minerals. me. It's actually not hurting me. Not I'm minerals. not. If this type of shit keeps happening to me, minerals. I'm going to quit streaming. And I'm not, not joking minerals. about that. Not enough minerals. I cannot stand playing this guy. He is a bad person. Good to go, sir. Not enough minerals. Do you actually see this? How he just went cannon rush from his main base. I am so done with this stream sniping from this fucking guy. I am so done with it. Oh, he says he doesn't stream snipe. Okay, that's great. That's great, guy in the chat. Go look at my stream the other day when he actually played me like six games in a row switching accounts between them. Yeah, he doesn't stream snipe. No, not at all. Not at all. Fucking idiot. He's the fucking worst. 